Hello, welcome oh, back. Shit. Yeah, we're starting again. Hi, welcome yeah. back. Uh, so I'm, we got. I'm uh, still doing this. Oh, uh, we got an opening line generator. Ten opening line ideas. Oh. I'm almost done with this level. I feel like. Uh. Hey, I got a life. Yeah. Only I didn't. Uh, interesting. So what I'm going to do is I want to go to the short story plot generator. So, name of the protagonist. Uh, set the scene. Launch into action. Focus on a relation. Launch into action. Resolution. Very violent. Actually, you know what? The resolution is going to be sad. It's going to be sad? Yeah. Not just sad and violent? It's the return oh. of Sinos Rose. Oh, no. So, Sinos Rose is the main character. He is male. The secondary character is... <laughs> the secondary character is... You know what? This is going to be a self-insert. A self-insert? Of you. Me? Yeah. DJ, you're the secondary character. Oh, fucking me. <laughs> <laughs> what does the secondary character want from the protagonist? What do you want? Uh, I want him to get a fucking life. Uh, get a fucking life. There we go. How does the second character feel about the protagonist? I feel like he's a lazy piece of shit. Positively or negatively? Negatively. Alright. Something the protagonist would like to say to the secondary character, since I'm the protagonist, I get to say this. There we go. The name of the place where it all began. Uh. Oh fuck! No! 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 Son of a motherless goat! Uh, let's see. Chicago. It began in Chicago. <laughs> Chicago? How does the protagonist feel about the place? He feels positively. A feature of the place: e.g., trees, houses, rivers. Chicago. Oh, thanks for throwing that in. Two adjectives that can be used to describe the place. Chicago. And windy. <laughs> you know what? It's just gonna be wind. Four emotions. Angry. Delighted. Irritable. Relaxed. An adjective that could describe an object. Uh... Squidgy. Wait. <sighs> Minuscule. There we go. Six adjectives to describe somebody's character. Mean. Giving. Controlling. Articulated. Uh, arrogant. Gentle. No! <gasps> <gasps> made it! Way to go you! <gasps> uh, an occasion. It's a dinner party. It is a dinner party. That sounds amazing. Jogging. Swimming. Skipping. Something yeah. semi-vulnerable. Singular. A baby! A toddler. You know what? A chicken. A noun you might compare the main character to. He's a gamer. Yeah, that makes sense. A noun you might compare the other character to. Brute. <laughs> Brute for sure. You spit on my ear. What I am fuck? so sorry. I feel so offended by you right now. A uh, type of music. R and B. R and B. The protagonist's favorite drink. Uh, squash. Two object objects. Sausage and blade. Currency. <laughs> Pounds. Oh, damn it, I chickened out like a bitch. Yeah. How does that make you feel? <sighs> I'm very disappointed in myself right now. Uh, a noun to do with the weather. Snow. I have no rings. Three animals. <laughs> snakes, snakes, and snakes! <laughs> Oh, you made it! Only I didn't. Two body parts. Fingers. Ankles. There we 
we go. Optional. Want to know where they're at? Nope. Finally, your pin name. Smoo. Smoo? <laughs> Write me a story. Oh no. It's getting there. Come on. Yes, 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 yes. Are you excited to see the story of Sinos and you? <laughs> yeah. Let's let's see what Sinos has been up to lately. Alright. It's still generating, so it's gonna take a while. That's fine. Yeah. In the meantime, uh, I fucking hate this stage. Mean Sinos Rose. Let's see. Let's keep going. Are you ready? I am prepared. Sinos Rose looked at the minuscule sausage in his hands and felt angry. He walked over to the window and reflected on his wind surroundings. He had always loved Chicago, Chicago, with its crazy, concerned Chicago. It was a place that encouraged his tendency to feel angry. <laughs> then he saw something in the distance. Or rather, someone. It was the figure of DJ. DJ <laughs> was an articulate brute with charming fingers and fragile ankles. <laughs> Sinos gulped. He glanced at his own reflection. He was a mean giving squash drinker with charming fingers and curvy ankles. His friends saw him as a gentle, gorgeous gamer. Once, he had even rescued an unkempt chicken from a burning building. But not even a mean person who had once rescued an unkempt chicken from a burning building was prepared for what DJ had in store today. The snow flurried like jogging snakes, making Sinos flex. As Sinos stepped outside, jogging snakes. As Sinos stepped <laughs> outside and DJ came closer, he could see the rotten smile on his face. Yeah, DJ awesome. glared with all the wrath of 3,502 controlling, squiggling snakes. He said in hushed tones, I hate you. And I want you to get a flipping life. It replaced fucking with flipping! <laughs> Sinos looked back, even more relaxed, and still fingering the minuscule sausage. Oh my god! DJ, give it to me. <laughs> he replied. They looked at each other with delighted feelings, like two squiggled, silky snakes swimming at a very arrogant dinner party. Which had R&B music playing in the background and two gentle ankles, uh, uncles skipping to the beat. Sinos studies DJ's charming fingers and fragile ankles. Eventually, he took a deep breath. I'm sorry, began Sinos in apologetic tones, but I don't feel the same way, and I never will. I just don't hate you, DJ. <laughs> DJ looked irritable. His emotions raw like a bad bright blade. Sinos could actually hear DJ's emotions shatter into 7,203 pieces <laughs> when the art articulate brute hurried away into the distance. Not even a beaker of squash could calm Sinos' nerves tonight. The end. What the f What in the holy hell happened? That, that You were apparently very mean to Sinos. Yeah, apparently. Yeah, I'm so appalled. Okay, so you know what's funny is... Hmm. We, uh... Sinos Rose is a character I, I made a long time ago with my brother. I need these... I need these things... Oh my I god! Because the Rose part was the part I came up with! Yeah. You just said Sinos! Sinos... Well, I mean, okay, so... It... Sinos... He, Turbo. I'm sorry, his name... Sinos Turbo, okay. No, 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 Turbo was his first name. Turbo oh. is what we ended up calling him. That's awful. <laughs> yes. Because, you know, Sonic and then Turbo. Yeah. And Turbo was the son of <laughs> Sonic and Amy, so it was Turbo Rose. Uh... And what's funny is he inherited his mother's uh, color. So he was pink. So he's pink. 
Only he dyes his spikes, you know, blue, so he's light blue. Oh, that's cute, though. <laughs> that's adorable. I love it. Yeah, we used to do, like, uh, uh, sprite comics with uh, Turbo. Oh, <laughs> uh, you made custom sprites and everything? He did. Yeah, he did all the, the sprite animations for it and stuff. It was funny. It was hilarious. Uh, I think you have to do the ground pound thing. No, it's not working. I just need the boxes. There oh, there they are. You just have to walk far enough away from them. Yeah, just take the one. Eh. Oh, he's gone. Fine. Gold ring! <laughs> <laughs> Done with this shit! Well, that's not any worse than what I did to it. Yeah, it's my turn now. Yeah, exactly. It's your fucking turn. Wow. Jesus. Wow. So. Oh my god! Easy. The devil's number. <laughs> Total score. <laughs> it's got a two in front of it and a zero at the end of it. Yeah, but the point is the sixes are together. <laughs> this game is cursed, DJ. What did I have to say? <laughs> Yay. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. I'm very scared. This story is called... Oh, wait. Well, well, yeah, we'll wait for... it's plot. It's important plot. We'll wait for the important plot to pass, even though it's stupid. Wow. My mind brain isn't powerful enough! Leave. leave. This Acting. Has been entrusted to the royal family. Fuck off, old man! So I must sacrifice this small child. I have a question. Why didn't Silver just offer himself to be the vessel for Illus? Because he's stupid. Because that would have actually been pretty poetic. Since yeah. he's trying to kill the Iblis trigger and then he ends up being the Iblis trigger. Yeah, but you see... But it has to be a royal soul. We don't know what silver is. He could be royalty. Oh, it tickles. And then he starts to die. <gasps> so remember that flash thing that you showed me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is that exact moment, I know. But also, it was like, whatever you do, you can't cry. But... Her father fucking dies. <laughs> and you've got this giant hedgehog that's just like holding on to her. It's like, sorry, your father. Yeah, he he's gone. Yeah. Remember, be brave. Don't cry. No matter. Remember. Be brave! Don't cry! <laughs> <laughs> he like collapses and his head collides with hers. Yeah. <laughs> and she immediately starts crying because he broke her nose. <laughs> I'm just like, Daddy! You should have died immediately from that explosion, old man. And she should be dead, too. And then he should have become the vessel. And then this story would make a little bit more sense. Well, not only would it have made more sense, it would have been an interesting twist. Correct. Because think about it this way. He's trying to kill Sonic, but Mephilus knows that Sonic is too strong. So it could have been like a situation where he's like, Sonic kills Silver, re releases the Iblis trigger. Right. That would have been yes. way better than this. <laughs> yep. Yes. The flames are properly set. And in that story, Silver dies. It's done. Ah. <sighs> uh, would have been perfect. Yeah. Happy ending for all except for Silver. <laughs> Fuck Silver. And now to give her the the rabies vaccine for later. 
Yeah, let me give this to you for later. I'll have to fuck You're with this later. To leave it behind? Yes. I already know what becomes of it in the future. It's time to return. Fucking time travel. I break it. Yes, of course. What? <laughs> Wakes up. Where's my dad? Oh, uh, 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 uh. So, he's no longer with but us. But she wakes up after Shadow's already gone, and so Silver's left her alone, like, uh, 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 go home, kid. It jumps through the portal. <laughs> what do you do? Don't cry. Don't you ever cry. <laughs> Don't you ever fucking cry. You hear me? You piece of shit. Oh, side note. She was unconscious when he told her that. So who tells her not to cry after that? <laughs> That's a fair point. I guess throughout her entire childhood, she just doesn't This is like cry. the most plot hole part of the entire story. Because oh. she's not supposed to cry. Her wrist is bending in an awkward way. <laughs> just breaks her wrist. <laughs> And then oh sets shit! It back together. My <laughs> mind brain is too powerful. <laughs> it's controlling my hands. Somebody stop it! <laughs> I just project. I'll spit in this general direction. Are you okay? I'm perfectly fine. All right. Just keep that shit away from me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I had to do like fake spits because I'm pretty sure if I did real spits, it would it would be spits. It'd be spits. Fake real spits. Blaze, what did you see? Everything. The, the whole world it. and its it stuff. Sonic the Hedgehog. I see. It wasn't Sonic the Hedgehog. Who would have thought that? You stupid fucking bastard. <laughs> They're quite noisy. Yes, I heard that the princess here left for Doctor Eggman's base in response to his earlier threat. What if his ultimate objective was to release Iblis? No. We can't let that happen. Can't let that happen. So this story is is called The Religious Cowboy. Did you use a generator or did you just find that? I found it. Oh, awesome. Are we going to offend anyone? Cowboys. Okay. <laughs> or cowboy fans. Which are trash. Which is fine. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! I'm going to stop Dr. Eggman no matter what. Uh, I hope I offended Please someone because I hate the cowboys. <laughs> um, uh, sure, you probably did. Uh, Whoa. Oh, it's another side quest. So a devoted cowboy lost his favorite Bible while he was... Uh, Mending fences out on his range. Three weeks later, a hedgehog walked up to him, carrying the Bible in his mouth. The cowboy couldn't believe his eyes. He took the precious book out of the uh, hedgehog's mouth, raised his eyes to the heavenward, and exclaimed, It's a miracle! Not really, said the hedgehog. Your name's written inside the cover. Hey. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you know that was funny. That was a very short story, though. This one's called Nasty Little Boy. A policeman caught a nasty little boy with a BB gun in one hand and a hedgehog in the other. Now listen here, said the policeman. Whatever you do to that poor defenseless creature, I shall personally do to you. In that case, said the boy, you can kiss my butt and I'll let it go. No! <laughs> ah. <laughs> Hiya. Ah, oh, that was funny. You should have laughed harder at that. That was funny as shit. I'm just uh, playing. Yeah. Ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Was that good enough? Oh, there's too many! No. Hiya! Take this! And that, and more of this. 
in that. A man in a movie job. theater notices what looks to be like a hedgehog sitting next to him. Uh, are you a hedgehog? Yes. Maybe. What are you doing at the movies? Well, I liked the book. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Uh wow. Ow. Why? Everything. Everything sucks. This game sucks. That's pretty much it. That's all that sucks right now. She's also dying. Hey, you remember that one with the giraffe and the lion? Well there's one for the hedgehog too. If I just died right here. Would that be okay? Yeah, go ahead and jump off. No. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Not in the game. Yeah, no, I just no, meant in no, real no, life. Just jump off on the water and you'll be fine. No. You won't even feel it. I just jump in through the water and you just stab me. <laughs> 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 See? You wouldn't feel it. You didn't know it was coming. <laughs> Why? A policeman in the big city stops a man in a car with a hedgehog in the front seat. What are you doing with that hedgehog? You should take it to the zoo. The following the, sa the same policeman sees the same man with a hedgehog again in the front seat. With uh, both of them wearing sunglasses. Pulls him over again. I thought I told you to take that hedgehog to the zoo. I did. We're going to the beach next weekend. <laughs> that was actually pretty good. <laughs> I like that. Rings! No, don't, don't, don't hear her. She's already dying. I don't want her to die more. Don't run in the direction of the animates! <laughs> Alright, that was a bunch of so uh, hedgehog jokes. How does that make I you see that. Good? It makes me feel great. Like, nothing I do matters. <laughs> Why are all these people here? Why did no one help? Where is Sonic? Because <laughs> Sonic sucks. He's dead. Or dying, I guess. Keep that keep that in mind for later. <laughs> I'm keeping it in mind. You did it! Yay! It, no, it's this. <laughs> wow. Great! Great! Get the fuck out of here, Silver. No one likes you. I like him. Not even Sega likes you. Actually, Sega likes him pretty decently. I know. Yeah. Since he was created solely for the Faces engine, which is one of the reasons why this game is so bad, you would think that they would want to forget him as soon as possible. You'd think. Yeah. But they don't. They don't at all. I'm sorry I dropped the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, cool, I can go in here now. Okay, bye. <laughs> you okay? Yes. All right. We're totally fine. All right. You get to end the video now. <laughs> oh, is it really the end? Yeah, let's see. 24, 24 minutes. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, thank you all for watching. Yeah. If you enjoyed this video and these terrible jokes and stories and things like that. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell us how you feel. You know, did, did we tickle your bum bums this time? Did, did you did you feel something? <laughs> oh, I feel something. <laughs> Be sure to uh, tickle that bell at the same time while you're at it because uh, that's how you're gonna see these videos. Yeah. Felt something. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye. Bye. <laughs>